So let's slow time down now. Like this, and everything's really weird. Hello everybody, I'm Dave Chaos, and welcome to a mod review. Oh my god, it's been so long since I did a mod review. It's borderline offensive, it's been that long. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, I was looking back, and I, I saw that, you know, my mod reviews were great fun. I used to really enjoy doing it, and uh, there's some fantastic mods that have been made like in the past few months because you know Minecraft's changed a lot over the years and uh, yeah you know I feel like doing the odd spotlight here and, here, here and there so this one is called time control and it's a very simple mod there's only a few different things that are in it but what it does is so much fun so you notice I've got these things in my inventory so we've got time control uh, remote uh, the Fast motion, slow motion, and the matrix remote. <laughs> it's so much fun. Oh my god. All right, so simple, simple recipes. It's kind of expensive, but totally worth it if you're going to do this in single player. And that's one of the points is this is only for single player, but still loads of fun. So the first thing you need is this time control remote. So the very simple one. So you need four diamonds, four gold, and a button, and that will give you this remote. Now, when you have all of the different controls, this remote, when activated, will randomly activate any of the others. That's pretty much all it does. Um, other than that, it's um, part of the recipe for the rest of the remotes. So you need your time control remote, the basic one, uh, to create the fast motion remote. So you put your time control in the middle, surround that with snowballs, and that makes your, your, your fast remote. And then for... This is the slow remote, yep, so you need another time shift. Uh, four sugar, and that'll make the slow motion one. And then the ultimate one is another time shift, and four more diamonds will give you the matrix remote, which is this one. Okay, so on the download, there's a few different textures, but these are the basic textures. Pretty simple, you know, they've got a T, an F, an S, and an M, so you know which one you're using. And, and the results of these things <laughs> so are, are brilliant. So I'm not going to bother with the time control because, like I say, all it does is um, it just picks at random one of the others. So we're not we're not going to bother with that. We don't need that. Let's let's bin that. So we've got our fast, our slow, and our matrix. So we're going to start with fast. Let's put them two out of the way. All right, are you ready for this? What this re what this basically does is make time really fast. Um, so anything in Minecraft that is controlled by time, it'll be sped up. Are you ready? Are you ready? So you simply do a right click and everything looks the same, but look at the speed of the clouds. Ooh. Wait until we try moving. Okay, let's go to that sheep. Whoa! <laughs> right, so it doesn't make you jump high or anything crazy like that. It just makes everything faster. So, Mr. Sheep. Oh, um, maybe I should hit one with a bow. Whoa, okay. Since when bows kill one shot kills, how about getting the cow? Ah! Oh, God, look how fast it's moving! Oh. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Ooh. Ooh. Pew! Got him! There we go. So, yeah, it's mental. You can get around really quick. And uh, if we just right click, like, it, it is kind of buggy. So, if I try double jumping, uh, I can't get into creative flight. Because it's just <laughs> so bloody fast. So if I switch it off, back into normal mode, and then get into creative flight, and then speed up time, look how fast you can fly in creative! Whoa! It's mental. It's super, super fast. <laughs> it's so cool. Now, let me just land. There we go. And there you go. So like the clouds are fast, time is fast, mobs are fast, you're fast. Everything that is governed by time is faster. So that's loads of fun. Great fun. Right, back to normal. Back to normal time. Oof. My God, that's better. Um, so now we've got the slow one. This one is kind of fun. We can do some Matrix style uh, shooting of the bow and arrow here. So, so this is normal speed. It, everything just feels so weird after being so fast. Right, so let's slow time down now. Like this, and everything's really weird. <laughs> right, so there you go. Everything's super slow. I'm slow. There you go. 
uh, such a struggle, right? Uh, but, like, here we go. So, let's shoot sheep. And the bow and arrow, the bow and arrow, like, even the bow pullback is slow. And the arrow should be slow. Ah, sometimes it doesn't quite register. It is slightly glitchy. But sometimes you see the arrow fly through the air really slowly like that. <laughs> it's so cool. So if we were being shot at, say, by um, a skeletal archer, pew, uh, we could almost dodge. Yeah, it's like bullet time, dodge, and the arrows. So I think we should have a go at doing that. Now then, let's see. Let's get a uh, spawner egg. Is That's a ghast. We don't want one of them. It's a sheep, wolf. Which one was a... Oh, there it is. There he is. Now then, if we spawn him under the tree. Ooh. Slow down time. He's not noticed me yet. Oh, of course he won't notice me. Hang on, hang on. I'll random do this. Uh, game mode. Zero. Ooh. Ugh. Uh, I'm not very good at dodging. Oh, <laughs> straight over the head. <laughs> Come on. Oh, no. I only have one arrow. <laughs> I've not got no one arrows. Crap. 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 Get out the way. Ah, there we go. We're good. We're good. Right, so if we just um, put time back to normal and speed things up a little. And then we could just... Arrow! Die, skeleton. Oh, crap. There we go. We got him. <laughs> awesome. Loads of fun. Okay, so... Right, we're back to normal now. Oh, everything feels so weird when you go back to normal time. Okay, right. What's next? Next is the Matrix one. Oh, my God. So, basically, the Matrix one emulates the Matrix. <laughs> There's no other way of saying it. Oh, it's time dark. He's going time. So, uh, no, no, we'll leave it dark. Why not? So, we do game mode one and get ourselves some whole load of arrows and then we can have some fun in matrix mode kill man just a few more there we go cool and then we can get out of this mode go back into game mode uh one isn't it whoops nope wrong silly me see you can tell it's been a while <laughs> because i can't remember the commands there we go okay it's so got one spawner egg. I'm sure that uh, some of mobs will start spawning all over the show in any minute now. Any minute now. Right, Matrix Mode. So what Matrix Mode does is super funky fun. Kind of emulates what the Matrix does. So mobs and time slow down. But your movement speeds are fast. So it feels like the Matrix. So let's do it. Right click. Oh, oh, the field of view's changed and everything. So weird. Okay. Whoa, this this is so weird. Um. Oh, oh. Can I? There we go. I've, I've changed to my bow. So I'm running around like a loon, but everything's moving so slowly. Ah, oh, it's bizarre. Right. So if we get our spawner egg, number three, and spawn. Whoa! What the hell? Uh. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god. Whoa, see that slow motion arrow? I'm a bloody zombie! Get him! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we died. Well, this is going to be interesting. How am I going to get my stuff back now in slow motion? <laughs> All right, I've respawned. Um, I'm miles away from where I was. I don't even know which direction I flew in to find a nice patch of land. So <laughs> there we go. Um, I di when I died and lost all my matrix controls and all the rest of it, um, when I respawned, I was still in matrix mode. So that's something to note. Um, yeah, if you die, you're going to need another remote to revert whatever you've Done. That's going to kind of make things a little bit difficult, but still super fun mod. <laughs> really enjoyed it. So, as always, there are links in the description if you want to download this mod. It is run by Forge, but, um, you know, 
things are so much simpler nowadays on how to install mods and things like that. Um, I use MultiMC. The link for MultiMC is also in the description. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, let me know if there's any other mods out there you want me to check out because I'd really love to get back into doing these little mod reviews. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you next time. Bye.